Tasty and all this. Drink more water. So today I'm very excited to show you some some stuff that I have actually been sent to me by Alpaca. I don't know if you know anything about Alpaca bags, but Alpaca makes beautiful bags. They are based in Melbourne. And this is to me, Alpaca. Keep moving forward. Okay, before I run down on the alpaca bags, I also want to mention uh, there's something that I do realize and I do appreciate in the alpaca bags. If you notice, look at it. Look at the material. You look at look at it. It's like the little X X X X X. Can you see it? There you go. Alpaca actually uses this fabric, the X Pack fabric. So X Pack fabrics, they have many grades of X Pack fabrics, but basically in general, without making you confused and everything, X Pack. Fabrics are very durable and tear-proof and best of all, they practice a lot of environmentally friendly practices within the organization and the material they use. So X-Pack package, uh, X -Pack fabric is something that I do appreciate being used in all, the, all to most of the alpaca bags. Zip clutch. So the reason why I fell in love with this zip clutch mainly because of my cycling lifestyle and one of the best things about cycling lifestyle is this. Always I have a problem in fitting a wallet into my cycling kits or my cycling bag because whenever I have a case, it just doesn't go in. But once I have a phone case with this one, they allow me to slide it in like that. I tell you, game, game changer. It's just so simple. I just slide it in. And nowadays, most of the high-end phones are already what IP60, IPX67. So those are already waterproof. So I'm, I wouldn't be worried. And these bags are, as well, can see the zip, the YKK zip, which all these are. YKK zip, which is also uh, water, water sealed, waterproof sealed from splashes, which is very good. So I do not use this zip clutch like how Alpaca uses it. I actually use it differently, which is actually I just use it as a wallet. And this is how I use it, like this. That's it. So do remember when you put your wall, cycling wallet into your back pocket, always make sure it's hidden. I know some female cyclists, right? Their pocket might be a bit shallow, so you might want to double check. Okay, so basically how I use this alpaca pack is actually pretty straightforward. Um, when I go cycling, I, I always vlog with my GoPro, so I will have an, ex when an extra battery inside my GoPro. I have cards, access card, credit cards. I also have, of course, some cash, some form of cash. Uh, I don't know what's this, what's this? Oh, some to-do list, which I think I've done that already. Thank you very much. And also there's a pouch where I put my phone here, which you can see. <clears throat> and I have my stickers, which is very important. I have my driving, my keyless entry car key, some coins. Always like a wallet with a bit of zip because you just want to put your coins inside. And of course I have my little GEC knife. It's a little scalp knife that I always carry around. You never know. So, all these knives, plus my little handmade leather pouch, because I don't want to scratch it. Put it back inside here. And one of the, the, the things that um, you need to know is this. By packing everything I have inside my wallet here, right, and using it every week, uh, it might look a bit bulky, but to be honest, it's actually pretty pocketable because of how they created the wallet to be separated the cards here. So when the cards are separated here, and I just put whatever <laughs> really organized cash I have here, it actually bends quite nicely. So even if I leave my battery inside here, in fact, I just leave my battery throughout the week here. So because it bends nicely, if I do not have my phone here, it bends nicely, always when I put it in my pocket, it's not too bad. Right? It's not too bad mainly because if I do sit down or I do bend or whatever, the wallet bends together with you. So I do appreciate that. And the other thing that I like about the alpaca, this zip clutch itself is of course of the very bright orange color interior. Retails at 42 US dollar. Look it up. So here's the measurement. This is 185 mm, 110 mm. It fits four to 12 cards. Interior orange uh, ripstop nylon. Fabric, so it does come with a hand strap where basically it comes like this. So having the hand strap, of course, you know you can just do this. But I, I don't know, I never do this. And waterproof YKK Aqua Guard zippers and weatherproof fabrics. And again, it fits a relatively large phone like this. 
So right now I'm using a Samsung S21 Ultra. It will fit your iPhone 14 Pro Max. Uh, it would not fit, I will tell you, it would not fit those fold phones like Samsung fold phones or, or any thick phones. So yeah, so if you are into putting pens and stuff, they do have, they did make little small compartments here to put your pen, maybe your torch light. I do have my OLED torch light here. There you go, if you are into that. But because I said this is my wallet, so I do not tend to put too many things here. I just want to use it as a wallet. Lah. So this is the zip clutch, which I really love. And I would highly recommend it for any cyclist who needs an everyday wallet. At the description below, I'll give you a link where you can click via prom promo code down there, which is a affiliate link. So I, I do hope you support this channel by purchasing it through the link. Lah. So now I'm going to introduce to you the Bravo Sling Mini. So for this Bravo Sling Mini, it's pretty straightforward. It's something that uh, usually people use it as a fanny pack design, but it's actually nowadays, I assume younger people just sling it over their shoulder, which is, which is what I do. So Bravo Sling Mini is pretty straightforward. Basically, there are three slips here. They Oh, uh, three zips, the front small zip, main zip compartment, and also the rear zip here. They have a little uh, plug here, which is to use to be a stabilizer. Alpaca does sell a stabilizer where you connect this to the strap here where it's going to harness ar around your chest so it's going to stabilize it if you're going for a run or hiking this and that so this basically uses the, the similar very wonderful uh, fa uh, material from X-Pack and it, this fabric if you look at it basically is indestructible I tell you I've been using alpaca products I've also checked with some of my cousins who's been using alpaca for almost what 5-4 years I guess and he told me that it's actually very durable he absolutely loves it so on this alpaca sling mini the three pockets, basically what I have inside here is the first pocket at the front, which is a small pocket. And now what I put here normally is I put my Benchmade bug out. I have my lighter plus a refill canister. And what else do I have here? I think that's about it. And in my rear pocket here, the hidden compartment, normally you can put a passport or whatever. I usually put my zip clutch and the main compartment is usually where I actually do put my phone. So it's actually pretty empty right now, but you know, uh, there's this uh, material here that's supposed to help you not scratching any screen. And, and actually this actually is built for the Nintendo Switch. Fits a Nintendo Switch or a, a, a folded headphones nicely. But for me, I don't use folded headphones. I just use a nothing ear one earphone, which, you know, portable and compact. I have two packets of tissue, mainly because, you know, I'm a dad. <laughs> You know, that's you carry tissue and then we go to restaurants, we got extra tissue, we also take lah. I have a marker pen, which, ha, ah, Sharpie. I should, I carry this wherever I go, it's so useful. I have a mini pen, a zebra pen, which is the, you know, the one that can just extend from big to small. Very useful to have it around as well. And this is something that I also carry on an everyday basis, which is a hand sanitizer. So I actually bought this from Shopee. I know this, this is not, this is not an alpaca product, but I want to show you this. This is brilliant, look at it. Basically, I, in, I put a hand sanitizer inside here, spray, and it's actually a refillable one. Look, brilliant. Oh, I have to refill it soon. So this is my hand sanitizer I carry day to day for my kids and my family. And this is the sling bag. Very simple. Again, I love the interior. Bright, easy to find things inside. The only uh, thing that I would ap appreciate Alpaca to do this bag, to change this bag, is to actually make it a bit thicker at the side so I can actually put more things because it it being slim, it does limit what I can put inside here. So let me show you how it looks like when I sling it around my shoulder once I put everything back in. This just goes around here. There you go, that's it. Over the shoulder, chest back. Retails at 79 US dollar. You, you can check this out. So let me show you the other products that Alpaca sent me. As they sent me a lot. They are, they are and also folks are there. Okay, the next thing that they sent me is, is a bit on the three combo hit for me. It's something that I actually do use three of them one shot. Let me just tilt the camera down. They have the Element tech case right here. They have the utility pouch here and they have the Element backpack black. So I'm gonna show you the, I probably will show you the smallest to the biggest. Okay, so this is the utility pouch. Uh, this retail, this retails at 49 US dollar. It is the X-Pack material. This is made out of a rugged 500 denier Cordura face fabric, waterproof, tear resistant, highly abrasion resistant. Yeah, all alpaca bags will last you pretty long because it is abrasion resistant. 
And if you look at it, it has a nice little alpaca logo right here. Zip at the front, zip at the back. And the main compartment. And they have a hand carry. I like this hand carry thing here. I don't know, I just like it. Because when I do take out this, this, this bag from anywhere, I just carry it here, like it's very useful. And also they have a little strap here, which actually connects to this. They do provide additional straps. You just put it here, lock it. And now from a utility pouch, it becomes not just a pouch for you to put in the bag, it actually becomes something you can carry it along, which is uh, pretty useful. Measures at 20 cm, 12 cm, and the depth is 4.5 cm. Okay, I'm gonna open the main zip at the front. The main zip at the front is enough, but probably small stuff is black though, so I can't really see what's inside. Like I said, this chef probably designed it like bright orange, which is something that I do appreciate from the other bags. But thankfully, the other zips inside, the rear pocket one is very bright orange. I just absolutely love it. Put so many things right here. Zip at the back. But the main compartment that I actually use, I mean, I got, there's so many compartments, I, so, I, I just don't have so many things to put inside. So this is the utility part. So what I have is, I have my, of course, my, my Gerber utility tool. I have more hand sanitizer. I have my, um, this is the banter. Uh, banter knife, I have a Zebra uh, EDC pen. I love this pen. It's a compre it's a, it has, yeah, it's a nice pen, anyway. Uh, I have a SIM kit remover right here, if you can see it right here. This is so understated. You should always have it and carry it around with you. I carry some pills, some do some papers, whatever I have at the big pocket here. And if I just open up here, I have a Zippo lighter. And I just love this measurement tape. I think as cyclists, uh, we always measure our height, our inseam, our chest, our uh, tummy, our thighs, our what else do we measure? Our even our head. Can you see? We can even measure our our head because we are like buying helmets and that. So I always carry a measurement tape wherever I go. I just find it so useful. Does it work? Oh, I need to re I need to re refill. So this is what I carry. These are my EDC tool bag where I actually put all my daily usage stuff here on the strap. But this is how I actually use it. This is my backpack and usually I just stuff it at the corner here. And that's where it lives. So whenever I go, wherever I go on the weekday, there's, there, I know my tools are always at the side pocket. I'm going to the Element Tech Case. This is the Element Tech Case Max. Retails at USD $92. This one that I have is the black one, which is a VX21. Carbon neutral. Oh, I love all this stuff. Fits an iPad Mini 6. Fits a foldable headphone as well. Um, but right now, what I have is I, I don't have a foldable headphone. So I say I always carry a small earphones with me. I, I, I don't see the, the... Because in Malaysia, it's too hot to carry a big headphone, right? So I normally have in-ear headphones. So let's just open inside. There's a front pocket here. Again, this uh, for this one, it's fully waterproof. I can see the fabric here. Fully waterproof. The zip here is waterproof, uh, resistant as well from YKK. Has a very nice handle, car uh, handle carrier here. And this one also comes very interestingly with these straps as well. So this one allows you to, similar like the utility case, you can just hook stuff around here. You can hook all these straps around your bag, which then allows you to use it as a everyday sling bag as well. So there you go, see? That's your similar like the, the sling mini. And the straps that Alpaca gives normally is so nice and soft. That's something that I do appreciate. It's like those seat belt material, really nice. But I don't use those straps because this is my everyday bag that I put it inside my backpack. And this is what I have inside here. It's very big. Look at it, how large is it? I have my SSD hard disk, tons of cables, Type C, another SSD hard, 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 hard disk, earphones, Type C earphones. What else do I have inside here? I have my pencil case. I use them actually, to be honest. I always use my phone. I have more cables, my uh, Aftershocks charger, my watch charger. I have extra batteries here as well, I think. Oh, yeah. More cables. This is my Ugreen um, Type-C uh, hub, USB hub for my MacBook. Uh, my mouse is in office. I, I can fit uh, my mouse inside here, but it's in the office. I'm so sorry. So, 
They created this so that, you know, when you open it big, it doesn't spill stuff down, which is pretty good. They have a lot of uh, compartments here. Pouches for the mouse, for, for mini headphones or cable management. They have a zip here for you to just uh, put memory cards, put a GoPro, GoPro batteries easily can fit here as well. There are three slots here for you to put. In the middle part, there is a magnetic, very nice magnetic slot here. I like this magne magnetic slot here mainly because for my more fragile Type-C earphones, right? I, I use this for call conference with my MacBook and or, or whenever I need a Type-C earphone. I do like the magnet because as soon as I roll this up, it's so easy for me to just open up the magnet here. Just throw it in, snaps, and the, the cable becomes organized. I like this magnet. And more big, this is, this, is a, this is the large compartment here where you can easily put a headphone or iPad mini. And within this black area here, you can see this black fabric here is the, uh, is the, the material that they use so that you can put uh, your phones or your screen, iPads or whatever, and doesn't scratch your screen. It's like those microfiber material stuff. And they have a little, probably a pen pouch here which you can put stuff here, yes, I know. Okay, so this tech organizer is really big. I highly recommend this because I really just throw everything inside here. And also, one of the things I also throw here is, uh, is actually my um, MacBook charger adapter, the brick. I put it inside here as well together with my mouse. So this is like when I sit down in the office, I just take the whole bag out and I'm happy to go. But right now, my charger is being used by the camera. Camera ran out of juice. So. So this is the Element Tech Case, retails at 92 US dollar. This one, I recommend. I love this so much. My goodness, ridiculous how much I like this. I really use this one. I have no complaint about this product. I actually love it. And how I use this Element Tech Case Max is actually pretty straightforward. You know, the backpack that I have, the Element backpack. Basically, if you look at this backpack here, I just stuff it inside. And now I have a very organized bag. As soon as I go to office, if I need anything out, I just pull out this and everything is out and I can start <laughs> going on my day. Okay, so now I'm going to start reviewing this big baby here. This is the Element Backpack. How am I going to show you in the screen? Let's figure this out. Okay, this is the Element Backpack uh, Black X50 Limited Edition and this is absolutely my favorite bag I've used. I've used many other brands of bags throughout my life. In fact, I got more bags than my wife. I can't tell you that. And let's go scroll through the material of this bag. This bag is using a rugged 500D Kodura face fabric for a highly abrasion resistant, tear resistant, waterproof material. Wow. Can mandi areas can play, play in the rain. That's pretty cool. Uh, besides all the other stuff, of course, you have a ballistic nylon bottle panel. If you look at this here, this looks really tough, man. You just put it on the floor, nothing happens. Just indestructible. 24 liter capacity. Okay, so this is a 24 liter bag. I'm gonna show you what I actually put inside. And I'm gonna go through what it has. I mean, the all, all the compartments and everything. So let's go through the front part. It has a little zip compartment, which fits your phone nicely. And I like it because it's flat down here, see? This flap just covers the zip. So if you forget to zip your bag, it's not shown, that's nice. And when the rain comes down, it's not gonna hit into the zip. You have, of course, a two side pocket for the bottle or maybe you can put umbrella. But what I do is, like I said, I put my utility bag here, this one. And on my the other side, it fits nicely a one, 600 ml or one liter bottle. It fits nicely a bottle. Put this aside. And what I have inside here, of course, all the, all the backpack comes with a zip with the hole where you can put your padlock here in case you're traveling and you put it in your, you know, the luggage compartment on top of the aeroplane, on top of your seat, at least you know your bag's not going to be tampered. So what's inside the bag, obviously, one of the nice things I like about this bag, it allows you to zip open really big. So yeah. Alpaca have this hub system, which is a magnet style, like a keychain style, where you can actually hook it all around this area here but I for me personally I think this I prefer something a bit more clean and a bit more pocket I would appreciate if Alpaca actually instead of doing the hub system I think a bit of more pocket would be nice for me personally lah. but right now they do provide me enough pocket like for example here I do bring an extra earphone 
have here, I bring a card reader here because I do I did a lot of videos lah. Then here is where I normally carry more uh, power banks or brakes, uh, charging brakes or whatever. But right now I'm using it, so it's not inside here. This bag is big, and of course, right inside here I have my Element Tech Case Max stuff right inside. And if I don't use it, you can look at it. It's so big. I can put so many things inside here. Look at that. This is a huge compartment of stuff. And even when I put my element package inside, I can still put like probably a day clothes and towels and stuff inside here. So it's pretty good. And I have a type C cable, which I use for my 16 inch external monitor. If I do work outside of the office and I have a MacBook Pro 13 inch. <sighs> Some documents, of course. This bag retails at 189 US dollar And right now I'm using a 13 inch because I actually kind of like smaller stuff lah. But to be honest, the, the bag is so big I think honestly speaking, if you don't mind, you can even put two MacBook Pros here Which is of course they have the little harness here The chest strap which is magnetic, I love it I, I don't know, I think something about men, we just like magnets <laughs> And of course it is removable Right here, if I, if I don't use it, I can actually remove it from here and they have all these little, nice little straps here where you can actually use it as a keychain or whatever, you know, you can hook stuff around with a carabiner, carabiner or whatever, those, those climbing hooks. Um, they have a airflow, nice large airflow area here to make it cool. But one thing I really love about this, this is the best. Check it out. I don't know if I can show it to you, but check this out. Check out this fence, this is crazy design. Check this out. It's like a 3D contour, like little mountains, all sharp edge here. It's sharp, but it's so nice and comfortable. It's so breathable. When I wear it, it's so cooling. This is the best backpack strap I've ever used. I don't know, it's just, it just blows my mind. Right now, I've been using it for almost four months. It still looks so new. I think this is pretty durable. Lah. And because of this 3D contour design, right, I think it allows airflow to go in. And this bag, I can tell you, is not that short. It's actually quite a tall bag. But it being tall bag, so that it can fit more things, also makes it a very slender bag. So this bag is perfect for commuters if you're stuck, or if you're going onto a train or whatever, and you don't want something that, you know, there are a lot of backpacks that's really like this size, but this one is just so slim. After you put it on, I can tell you the bag just, it's such a slim profile bag. It's so slim. Thank you so much guys for watching. This is my review of the Alpaca bags that's given to me, sponsored to me by Alpaca. Thank you so much again, Alpaca. Uh, basically, I'm a cyclist and I think you have to get the zip clutch. And once you get the zip clutch, it's down the rabbit hole. There are so many other beautiful products they have from Alpaca. And if you're interested in any of the Alpaca products, there, my affiliate link is at the description below. Get it, click on the link, buy any of the products there, you get 15% you get 15 discount courtesy of Melvin. Me. I'm not really like actually from Alpaca, la. they just give it to me to give it to you. La. But anyway, it's always nice to get some discount, ain't it, guys? So take care, you guys. God bless, and I hope you check out the Alpaca and enjoy it.